morning all and let's see this beautiful creation what do you feel by just looking at the problem yeah there is only one way to do this problem is not to do it right that's your first thought well hold your patience and you can do it so the first thing is don't get fear out of these big numbers which has been a usual style of recent j it's just because to keep in sync with the j year of course by looking at the problem s is the set of x y z belonging to real numbers such that there is an equation one equation in three unknown so that's going to really be a headache let's have patience and read the next part so we need to find minimum value of this expression when x y z belonging to s now in this kind of problems you must have done before maybe not the similar one of course not the congruent but the idea is when you have a single equation and more than one known so a typical example and a trivial example is x square plus y square plus z square is zero a very crucial thing is x y z has to be real so under this restriction we'll have unique solution of zero 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 so either everything gets settled like something is square for which there is no hope in this problem because we have linear terms the next idea may be probably to directly open it sin a plus b plus c but that's going to be more disastrous i guess at least in the first go so just blindly opening sign of has plus a star plus half moon is definitely seemingly not possible over here so what can be the third thought process well you might be tempted of using component or dividend i mean like you might add this and add this but anyways sign of this monster plus cos of the same monster that's also important thing because these two guys are exactly same will be provided so maximum you can write is 2 sin root 2 sin has plus pi by 4 or equivalently in cos format so that's also not going to scabonio dividend also feels quite slippery over here uh, because of these terms right even this plus this will give uh, very bad mixing so now what else we can do see we have done everything except one thing which is an observation right and that's very crucial in these kind of problems and especially in general for problem solving so what's the observation before you directly go and hit the problem first observe the information given and what is to be next so we have 2023 4 5 3 4 5 we have 3 4 5 separated here same goes to 3 4 5 and they are asking everything except 5 missing, 4 missing and 3 missing. Well, so this gives a hint. So we want, if I want to complete this, so maybe my motivation is to see 2025z minus 2025z. And I can see this entire term over here. So that gives a motivation of sine has minus a star, sine a cos b minus cos a sine b which demands to ask for sign of something it's clearly available here cos of 2025 z available here in cos of something well in sine of 2025 z well we have cracked the key again in this term it will demand sign of this guy cos of maybe this one cos of this guy and sign of this one so everything is level hence it feels as if we have cracked it so what I can do is we can take this box as sign of 2023x plus 2024y plus 2024z and we'll multiply with let's say cos 2023x and then I'll keep the same thing on that side so it's cos of this entire monster in sign of 2023x of course plus two similar terms like this is zero just by cross multiplication in the first guy is nothing but sine of a minus b so this entire chunk gets to sine of 2023 x plus 2024 y plus 2025 z minus 2023 x as you can see it's sine a cos b minus cos a sine b so that gets killed off and we have nicely this one left over here what else we want in life exactly in the same fashion we can tell for second and third and since i've transported everything on one side so this is identically zero right so there is no meaning of minimum maximum hence this is always zero no value 
of x y z no matter what you choose and answer for this beautiful puzzle watch nothing this is zero if you are really enjoying and understanding the tactics of problem solving that's more important than just getting the answer it develops your interest in mathematical reasoning as well because you see what i've used is nothing more than sin a plus b formula so or sin a minus b formula which eventually can be derived by replacing b with minus b okay so if you are liking and understanding this kind of problem tactics please do like and subscribe the channel for more quality content for free thank you have a good day